at Praxis, we, we add on a wide range of impact strategies, um, including things like shareholder engagement, where we're talking with companies, trying to work with them on areas that we see as being potentially problematic or harmful to the world and its people. Wherever we work, we always focus on maximizing return within our risk constraints, because it's very important to have returns. And that's still a focus for Deverance. But on the other side, we have the dual mandate, which is being socially responsible with our investing, trying to make the world a better place. That's the thing that sets Everance different than everywhere else I've worked. Each piece is very intricate and complicated, but yet it really gives us a 360 view of a community and being able to serve in the financial field in a very complete way. We engage companies in conversation. We call it shareholder advocacy. And what that really means is a couple of folks on our team meeting with the managers of companies whose stocks we own, helping them to, to consider the impacts of their work on a broader range of stakeholders. We try to put those conversations in the context of, let's, let's do better for this company overall, not just uh, beating them up on things that we would like them to change. I've always been driven by uh, a, a deeply held set of values um, that come from my faith and the opportunity to see how those live out in a complex world uh, has always uh, been exciting to me. Money can be used to do a lot of good in community. On top of making a profit for the investors, you could really create those jobs and create a better environment for our children, be able to provide housing, and just do these different things that really affect communities in important ways. It's been exciting to be able to work with people that care deeply about not only um, the strength of our investing you know, acumen uh, and our ability to invest money well, but also to invest well and actually do positive things for the world at the same time. We're at a point in the history of this movement, I, I call it socially responsible investing. We come at it because of our faith as an organization and, and as in individuals, being both productive with what's been given by God, but also being responsible. And we've tried to balance those two ideas as we uh, put practice together and try to grow into the future. It means a lot to me to, to work for an organization that prioritizes faith and values and integrating that in, into what we do. It also helps keep me centered in my life, uh, both at work and at home. My family and I live in an off-grid house uh, where solar panels provide the power. We grow much of our own food, and that ties into this whole holistic belief of practicing what we believe in, and to be able to both uh, do that at home and at work, it's a, it's a great benefit. I really appreciate that. It's been wonderful to work with such a great team of very talented people who know what they're doing. They've been doing it for a long time. Also very, very passionate about this work. I've often said I don't think I would, would be here doing a portfolio manager job if it wasn't for this organization. And that's what's kept me here, is uh, the commitment to what the organization does. It's an imperfect world. Uh, we're trying the best we can to be honest and true to our faith values. We're in a great position here at the Praxis Mutual Funds with a, a, a core team that's been together for over 15 years. And uh, that brings a strength, a familiarity, uh, a, a sort of a resonance with one another that really has allowed us to, to move forward on some innovative solutions, to work on, uh, on projects together. And, um, and, and we appreciate that opportunity um, uh, to be of service to our community and to our clients. Looking into the future, I see a lot of opportunity to be able to invest in more and more companies and communities for impact and really leaving this world much better than we found it for our children, for their children, and for generations to come.